friends hi parents uh, coming back again with something new to add on winter seasons are on i have dr ravi with me i am dr shweta both of us are pediatrician and neonatologist from manipal hospital whitefield we dive in the topic of influenza disease which is the winter peak so uh, i'll ask dr ravi about it how is the epidemic of influenza currently if you take 2024 what do you feel yeah so since covid uh, uh, most of our patterns have changed so this year specifically during summer usually things are very calm as you would have seen but starts uh, june july when the temperature drops and uh, uh, school starts so it's a very good conducive environment for the viruses to uh, grow multiply and uh, spread to each other so most of the common problems what we come uh, every day in our day to day practices children coming with or parents coming with their children with runny nose cough cold fever and that has been the main stay of uh, uh, cases what we are seeing so such cases when they come what will be your approach how do you uh, manage them and what do you tell parents so uh, there is lots of confusion among the parents when it comes to influenza parents say flu like viruses flu what is flu and what is influenza i would firstly tell them the difference between both two so simple flu viruses will just land up children with simple symptoms like cough mild fever which and mild cold the cough will not be that bad and 3 to 4 days the children will be out of that so we always tell them to wait and watch we keep them symptomatically without giving any challenge of any uh, investigation neither any treatment but if the symptoms have a different pattern like high fever which is ongoing ongoing going going beyond three days with cough which starts initially minimal but then it triggers a lot so in day 4 day 5 you see the cough is so bad that the child is continuously coughing there's where the catch and the child will be very tired the child will have body pain severe myalgia lethargy but then again the parents have a question doctor we uh, are not able to understand when to we test so that's where we tell them come after 72 hours from the start of the treatment mm. and then we see how to go ahead further mm. dr ravi don't you feel that uh, there is a question which the parents keep asking doctor we have given influenza vaccine still the baby can get flu how come how do you uh, under- explain this justification so usually most of the vaccinations what we give for flu in terms of their efficacy we see some of the studies will give between 60 to 70% protection for all this so in, that's why i tell parents that in this, let's say in a year you are supposed to get 10 times uh, cough and cold at least 6 to 7 times you are protected but at least 3 to 4 times there is a possibility you still get it and when you get it you might not get to the full blown what you get because you our body is sort of immune so the chances of you requiring a lengthy uh, time off the school or uh, getting well might be reduced so that is the usual thing you do